Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, what I need you to do right now is I need for you to give me all that fun, loving, super and beautiful energy that you got. You can do that by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. You can just do all those beautiful, magical, glorious things that you do to me so well here at Tidy's Terror. So, I'm going to slap down the holy water. Whoa. Raise that vibration, baby. So, Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Tarot is now in session. The most honorable judge, T.T. T. Dong, presiding. You may all be seated. Pisces. This is going to be for my single Pisces. I've been asked to do a singles reading several times. So, I'm going to do a singles reading to see what you can expect for the rest of the month. So this is for my single Pisces, and what can they expect for the rest of the month? Let's go. What can single Pisces expect for the rest of the month? Show me what single Pisces can expect for the rest of the month, please. Single Pisces can expect for the rest of the month. Okay. All right, Pisces, let's see what we got here. Okay. Oh, Pisces. Okay. What can you expect for the rent rest of the month? There's something here, Pisces, um, that it's been a little bit of a burden here, okay? Um, but it's a joyful burden here, okay? I don't know what's going on here, single Pisces, for the rest of the month here. Um, uh, your children... You could be, honestly, there could be a lot going on right now with your children, okay? It's been kind of heavy. You love your kids. Do they, are there ups and downs? Yes. Have you had to rearrange your schedule? Yes, okay? But whatever it is, I feel like you have been nurturing your children here very much, okay? You've got a lot of determination and a lot of willpower here to make whatever happens here happen. Especially if you have children, for the sake of your children. I'm getting strong, strong energy of children here. Um, there's a new journey here on the horizon, Pisces, and it looks like you're going to be doing um, some traveling. There's something here also that you've been longing for, Pisces. So we're going to get into this reading here. And we're going to dive deeper for my single Pisces on what you can expect for the rest of the month here. So, what's the six cups here for Pisces for what they can expect for the rest of the month? What's going on? Okay. Well, it seems like someone or something here that you thought highly of here, it looks like there's been a lot of heartbreak around this, okay? I don't know what or who, but there's been some kind of heartbreak around a certain individual here that you're very upset about, okay? You care a lot about this person. You think fondly of this person, but it's still like you're heartbroken over some kind of situation. What's, what's the situation that Pisces is heartbroken over? There's been a ending here, okay? There is a connection here with somebody here, and it there's been just a straight ending here, okay? I'm just getting that. But what I can say is that this ending here was a consequence of somebody somebody else's own actions here, okay? And honestly, I feel like this has been it's been a burden here, okay? You were waiting and waiting around here for somebody here to offer you a connection here okay you wanted a committed relationship here okay 
But what it's saying right now is that this is... There, this is time for a new you, Pisces. There's a new sense of you coming here. And there's some other things that you've planted with other people here in other situations um, that are getting ready to come into fruition after you mourn this loss of whatever this situation was between you and another individual here, Pisces. But I can feel like you're going to be moving away from... Uh, the deceptions here of what this person has done to you and I feel like it's going to open you up for new love here Okay, that's what's coming through here on this energy in particular Okay, so What's going on with strength here for what Pisces can expect for the rest of the month? Let's talk to strength for what my single Pisces can expect for the rest of the month What can my single Pisces expect for the rest of the month here with the strength? Okay So, I feel like whatever is going on here, I feel also that you've been closed off very much emotionally here. And I feel like you've been shut out to everybody. You've been shut out. You've been, you've been closed off emotionally here. And you've been working by yourself here, trying to get through um, this, this, this ending here. And I feel like this ending here that you have went through uh, this person's energy here was very toxic and there was a lot of hidden things here that always left you wondering what was going on here okay and I feel like there's also been a point here where you could have been doing a little bit too much drinking because of this here and right now you're trying to restrain yourself from drinking so much here and I feel like there's an angelic presence here that is coming in or real soon, if not now, that's lifting your spirits up. Um, it's pulling you out of the cold and you're starting to find your happiness. And I feel like you have been doing a little bit of reflecting here on this past person's energy. But ultimately here, you are much better off um, without this energy that keeps holding you back and keeps draining you here, Pisces. And so... You've been closed off very much emotionally here, okay? And so, what's going on with the fool here? What's going on with the fool? What's Pisces getting ready to do with the fool? Something here that you've been talking about doing. What's Pisces been talking about doing with this fool? Okay, it seems like uh, you've been talking about going out somewhere, okay? You've been wanting to go out somewhere. You're wanting to captivate other people's attention right now. You're wanting, you're going, you're going out, Pisces. You've been talking about going out here and seeing other people. You're wanting attention right now from other people here is what you're needing. So I feel like you're going to start getting into the dating scene here. And there's going to be a lot of people that are going to be finding you very much attractive here for the rest of the month here. Okay, Pisces? So you're getting ready to go out uh, and attract a lot of different energies to you. And these people are going to be enamored here by you, by your presence um, and your charm. Okay? As well as people are finding you very, very good looking here. What's coming out of the Queen of Wands here with the Fool here? Let's go. But I feel like all these new energies that are going to be approaching you and talking to you here, there's going to be a lot of energies here talking to you. You're conflicted, okay? You're very much conflicted here. You don't know what to do. And I feel like this energy here that you're heartbroken over that has ended, that's opened up more room in your life to be able to go out and see people, um, date people, it's... All, I feel like you're just not going to trust anybody because I feel like you always feel like people are after you because of your physical appearance here. They're attracted to you, so you feel like people lack emotions here, okay? So you're looking for somebody here that is emotional here, but I, I feel like you're longing for love here and you're longing for somebody else to reciprocate love here 
and not just look at you as surface level energy, just as a flesh vessel suit here. So you're going to be up in your head about all these people that you're going to be attracting in this month. You could be talking to maybe about or seeing about five people here, okay, for the rest of this month and probably in through June here, okay? So let's go to the page of wands. Page of Wands. And what the Page of Wands is telling me is, boy, with this Five of Wands, it's like you're very closed off when it comes to even allowing love in. Whatever happened here with this person, you're not quite over it. You're not quite over it. But by going out and being around other people, that's going to allow you to do some healing here. Okay? So you're really needing to do some healing here from this person here that's really just absolutely broken your heart and absolutely has emotionally closed you off. You know? But I'm proud of you for getting out, though, and attracting new energies. This is something that you've been wanting to do for a while. That you've been talking to yourself about here. And it's happening. But it's going to leave you a little bit up in your head here. As to what you need to do here. Can we go any deeper here on this page, uh, page of wa uh, wands. The five of wands. Yeah, you're very, very closed off. You're longing for love, Pisces. But you're resistant. Okay, so it's like you are longing for love inside that child of you, that your inner child just wants to be held and just wants to be loved here. Okay, you really do. You want to be held and you want to be loved, but right now you are just really, really guarded and you just don't know who to trust. Okay, so for the rest of the month, you're going to be doing a lot of dating, a lot of flirting. But ultimately, you're still not over this person and you're still really conflicted here um, about who you can trust here. And at the end of the day, you just want to be held and you just want to be nurtured, but you're really closed off because this person did some real severe damage points to you. So, Pisces, um, this has been your reading. If you enjoyed it, you know what to do. It, I'm sorry it wasn't pixies, rainbows, butterflies, and stardust. But I'm here, um, and I'm here for you. So I love you, Pisces. Tarot's adjourned.